good morning friends uh, welcome to pulse fixture this uh, particular video will tell you how to add a printer to your PC to your personal computer or to your laptop so uh, the first thing which you need to do is you need to switch on your computer and then uh, on the bottom left hand side you will find the start button just go to the start button and uh, click on the start button now uh, once you click on the start button you will get this pop-up uh, you if you have the printers and faxes option available there you need to click directly on that if that option is not available you can go to control panel and either double click on it as I've done in this video or you could also do a right click and open now on this page on this window you need to go to the printers and faxes option I do a right click and then uh, click the open option just do a right click and click on open now you will go to this page where on the left hand side you will find the option option of adding a printer so it would say add a printer so just go to that option and uh, again either do a right click and open or just click on it so now you'll come to this page which says welcome to add printer wizard just click on next now when you come to this page you will get two options the first one would be a local printer attached to this computer and the second is a network printer or a printer attached to another computer so basically in this case you, you can choose either of these depending on what is the kind of printer you're using whether you're using a local one or a network printer in my case uh, in this video I am uh, showing the local printer so I'll just click on local printer and uh, go ahead and click on next and once I'll click on next I'll, uh, the laptop or the computer will start uh, start searching for the printer now in this case as you can see uh, we did not we were not able to locate a printer so I will have to manually go ahead and connect it so I just need to click on the next button even if even if your uh, PC is not able to find a printer you just go and click on the next button and you come to this po page so as you can see the LPT1 recommended printer port is available uh, I, w I would go with this and I would also suggest you to go with this you can also see a, p a picture is shown there of how it should be looking like uh, the port so I'll go with the recommended port and I'll choose the LPT1 recommended printer port and click on next now I've clicked on next now I come to another page here you will see what all options are available what all uh, manufacturing options so basically if you have an apple lap uh, apple printer you need to click on apple in my case i have a canon lap uh, a canon printer so uh, i'll go for canon and you can choose any of these depending on what uh, printer you have available so i'll click on canon and on the right hand side as you can see you will get all the options available for canon so if you have a bubble jet printer you need to click on bubble jet and so on and so forth so but actually in my case there is no printer I'm, I'm just showing you how it should be done or could be done rather so for example click on uh, Canon bubble jet BJC now this page here gives you an option of giving a name to your printer it helps at times because it helps you to identify your PC to identify your printer this name could be anything I mean it can be your name your pets name uh, your printers name so uh, as you can see there are many options available in my case I'll eventually go ahead and do a Canon printer but you can also do an Epson printer or, or anything basically so I will uh, rather uh, choose the name as Canon printer and once that is done I will click on the next button as soon as you click on the next button you will get an option of a test page so I've clicked on next now you can see do you want to print a test page I would want to print a test page because uh, that will show me how all my prints uh, would go so I'll definitely click on yes and then cl click on next you can also do a no but uh, ideally it should be a yes so do yes and click on next so yeah completing uh, the add printer wizard you just need to click on finish and uh, you're done with adding a printer to your PC or to your laptop now you'll get an option a pop-up again which would say yeah here it comes a test page is now being sent to the printer so this is the same test page which we identified initially you just need to click on OK right now when you will get back to the original page it will show you can see here a Canon printer is attached to my computer so that's it uh, in this particular video what we have done is we have added a, a printer to your PC to your laptop and uh, this is how you can do it very very simple for other simple videos keep on watching pulse fixer 
and uh, get empowered so you have a happy day ahead you have a good day ahead take care thank you for watching pulse fix app bye bye